Hello, hello, happy Monday. How are you all doing tonight? We are doing well here. Um, I always like to share that. Um, but yes, like many of you in the title of tonight, it does happen. We all have that um, fear that <laughs> as winter hits that we're all gonna not be doing so well. So I wanna share with you some of the products that our family uses on a daily basis or when we start getting that inkling that someone isn't feeling well and what things can you use to kind of help boost everything going on in the home. Well, first and foremost, at home, one of the biggest things that we do every single day is diffuse. Um, there are just so many good essential oils out there as far as doTERRA's different blends and singles that are very neutralizing to the air. They're great for cleansing the surfaces and even kids' hands as they touch everything and sneeze in them and things like that. So diffusing has always been the easiest because it affects everybody in the house. If you do have a stuffy nose, you can diffuse like the, the one favorite oil we have for anything nose related is the Breathe Essential Oil Blend. So a few drops in the diffuser, run that at bedtime, that really helps keep things open. If by chance you have some gunk going on in there, two things I like to do. I like to throw thyme essential oil into in with my breathe in here. That worked awesome for my husband when he was on his third antibiotic for a sinus infection. Within three days, it was gone. Like I wish I would have thought of that when he was on the first round, but you know, it made a believer out of my husband, which was a great thing. So anything like that, I like the breathe and the thyme. Really helps work on the respiratory and even adding the thyme to the chest. I wasn't going to talk about respiratory support today, but I guess I am. Um, and the other oil that I like to diffuse is the On Guard Essential Oil Blend. And this one I also clean with, so I'll put a few drops in a spray bottle. I'll mist all the surfaces down, door handles. We even make wipes. Um, we have a great recipe on our team page for wipes and wiping down the surfaces and things like that. These two oils are two that I always diffuse if someone is not feeling well. Um, and if there's for some reason you can't use one of the oils in the blends, you can create your own. There's lots of options. So Breathe and On Guard, two best friends when it comes to respiratory or immune support and affecting everybody in the home. Um, so that's diffusing. Topical use, if I feel like someone's starting to come down with, with something and I just want to try to start, start supporting the um, immune system. If you have not tried this yet, oregano. Um, oregano is a game changer. It is really, really supportive of your immune system. It's kind of like that natural way to just get things out. Um, and even with yucky noses, there's a girl on our team that um, I remember every time she'd bring her little guy up, he would always get a yucky nose up here at the farm. Um, so I don't know if he was allergic to the hay or whatever, but she would rub the oregano on the bottoms of his feet and within a couple minutes, his nose would start draining and he'd get all that stuff out. And it's like, sweet. Um, so anyway, I've always loved oregano. It's only something that I use periodically when the kids are, you know, like they're, they feel like they have something and they're coming down with something. Um, so oregano on the bottoms of the feet. And I would do this every couple of, you know, like every three, four hours. Like if you've got something going on, be hitting it consistently. Um, cause that's how you're going to get your best results. Um, so I do like that one, um, topically and then looking at internal support. So and I'm going to talk about oils first, and then I'm going to talk about some nutrition. So for kids, doTERRA has these really awesome On Guard beadlets. It's a quarter of a drop of the On Guard essential oil in a little gel cap, a little beadlet. They don't even realize it, and they can swallow it. Super, super awesome. So kiddos, um, my six-year-old, I would probably give him two or three beadlets every, you know, six hours maybe. Um and then more for the adult or the 100 pounds and up, I would really look at using the On Guard Soft Gels, the Plus. These also have, besides the On Guard Oil, they have black pepper, they have um, the oregano leaf along with Melissa. Um, so three powerhouse oils for really helping um, protect the body and the recovery process. So this is something that if someone in the house gets sick, I am taking these babies twice a day. Um, or if I'm going to travel, I take them. I'm re I really want to support the immune system. And I love it how they support the body in relaxation if you're in like a high stress environment. Because we all know as soon as we get a little stressed out, 
that's when things hit us because our immune system has now become compromised by stress. <laughs> so taking something like this consistently just helping support the body doesn't mean you're not going to get sick, but there's a really good chance that if you do, it's either not going to last it as long um, or maybe it just won't surface as badly as it could. So I really like those two essential oils for, um, you know, internal use and some other things that you can do too. Like I love adding lemon or the on guard or even Roman chamomile to honey and then mixing that honey into my hot water and drinking it as a tea. Um, that is really, really good to help soothe any irritation going on. Um, plus it tastes great. You're, you're upping your consumption of water because we all know water is a huge factor when you're not feeling well. Um, and then also, um, breathe in the back of the shower, um, is another great way. If you want, need that wake up in the morning, like just take a drip of the breathe and let it like sit on the back of the shower, the tub. Um, and then that heat just kind of gets those aromatic compounds going. It's really, really cool. Then for more internal support, and just like when you think about planting a garden, um, if you plant your, let's use corn as an example, if you plant corn in sandy, kind of rundown soil versus corn in very fertilized, very nutritious black soil, what is the two different corn stalks going to look like? And then when you think about stress coming in, maybe it's too hot, maybe it's not getting enough water, Maybe it's crowded with too many corn plants or you've got some bugs invading it. Like when you think of your body like this plant, um, what type of soil is going on inside the body? So what are you feeding the body? And this also plays a huge part in, you know, how often you get sick, how long does it last? So if you're really looking at nutrition within the body and good foods and lots of water, um, you're going to see, again, a much stronger, healthier body. That's just science. Um, so one thing I've used for the past four years is doTERRA's Lifelong Vitality Pack. So you have your basic vitamins and minerals, and it's actually equivalent to like 12 servings of fruits and vegetables as a daily dose. So even if I don't eat a good meal, I know that I've got the nutrition there. The omegas, the omegas are huge for your immune system, your joint function, your brain health. Um, your heart health, so much there. This third supplement is optional. So you can get this in a three pack or you can get it in a two pack. Um, this Alpha CRS is really more of for like energy and cellular function and just a, a whole body like health. Um, so I highly suggest, even if you're just taking a half a dose of this, um, giving this a try, especially in the cold and flu season, the winter months where your body is more stressed especially even going into the holidays, is more stressed than normal. So um, this is what I use for base nutrition. And then looking at gut health, because 80% of your immune system, you know, is all going on in here as well. So if you're not feeling good here, you know, it's just stuff just isn't working right. And one thing we've used a lot in our family is the terazymes. And these are enzymes that help break up food and dairy and um, proteins and fruits and vegetables. So it just helps your body digest those naturally. And this has helped a ton with, you know, gut health. Um, in fact, on our team page, I just did a Zoom call with a friend of mine out in New Hampshire who had bone spurs and um, uh, something, heel spurs going on. And she was sharing with me that two weeks of using these and how that really helped correct that. And that was really cool to hear her testimony on that. So I love the Terrazymes for boosting the immune system and gut health. But then one other thing that is a huge thing too, and especially if you've been on any antibiotics, or like I like to mention to people, if you've used oregano for like 10 days in a row, because oregano too is kind of like some of those over-the-counter products that we get from our doctor that kill both good and bad bacteria. So you got to always be thinking about how to boost that good bacteria in your tummies. And so thankfully doTERRA has two options. This is more what I call like the adult option. It's a prebiotic, probiotic, you know, um, pre and probiotic for gut health. 
And it's kind of, probiotics are kind of, or at least how I've been kind of taught to take them, rather than take them on a daily basis, you could do one with every meal for 10 days straight and then really get that boosted and then you can take a little bit of a break. And once a month, just take a few days and like take a bunch of them because they do store up in the body. The same thing with the enzymes. Um, so this is the adult version and then this is the kids version. And these are like a little pixie stick. They are so yummy. Of course, my box is taped shut. They're so yummy. So anyway, you just literally cut the top off and you pour it in. It's super yummy. And each one of these has six different strains of probiotics. So I think there's only one that overlaps between the two. So even if you're looking to swap out probiotics, do this one one month and then do this one one month and then swap back and forth. But I have heard so many moms say that if they have their kiddos use this all winter long, that they find that they do so much better in the winter months. So this is something worth considering, I feel, with kiddos. And I love that doTERRA's is double encapsulated so that when they take it in, the stomach acids don't destroy it. It gets into the intestinal tract where it can really be used. So um, something else to consider with trying to keep everybody well this, this winter season. So let me know which one of the products you thought was um, one that you definitely use all the time or that you'd like to learn more about. Um, and share some, you know, tidbits with us as far as what you all do when you're not feeling well and how you get yourselves well faster. So, and then don't forget to comment because I'm going to give one of these really cool products away. Maybe two. We'll see how many of you comment um, next week when I hop back on live to share some of my tried and true respiratory support oils. So thanks for tuning in this week, and I look forward to seeing all of your comments. And if by chance um, you have not seen our class schedule this week, um, everyone, of course, in this group is invited if you're local. Um, Wednesday, we're having a um, class in Burnhamwood at the Burnhamwood Town Hall at 530. Um, it's on pain and stress. And it's actually on my upline from Madison that's going to be teaching that class. So it's going to be a super fun class. Um, she's taught over 700 classes worldwide. She's an energy kinesiologist, mom of six. So she's been there too. Um, and then Thursday, we have a DIY holiday make and take class at Natural Living in Anigo. Um, we only have about five spots left. So if you're hoping to hop into that class, um, make sure to um, RSVP with me before the before Thursday. And then Saturday, I'll be at Ladies Night Out at the um, North Star Bowling Alley. So if you want to stop in and check out some of the doTERRA products, I will be there. And then Monday, I will be in Wausau doing another holiday DIY class with a gal in our team. So if you're interested in any of these classes, just comment below which class and I can get you the address and details to that. Um, and thanks, Robin, for sharing how much you like the kids' vitamins. I agree. A lot of people who um, ca don't care to do this many, um, you can do the kids' chewable and the kids' omegas. Um, super easy to do it that way, too. So um, thanks for sharing that. And anyway, I hope you all have a wonderful evening, and I look forward to seeing um, what you guys use. So have a great night.